everyone and welcome to another episode of Chirping from the Box. Tonight I want to talk about goalies. And you may be thinking to yourself, well, what's there to talk about right now? Scoring is way up thanks to this new equipment rule and everything's just insane right now. You're right about that. Scoring is up. It's actually kind of annoying in some ways, but these are professional athletes after all. And when you're an athlete, no matter how old or how young you are, you're taught that you have to adapt to any rules and your surroundings. And there are some goalies who have been adapting to those rule changes. And tonight I want to talk about three in particular. Yaroslav Halak, Pekka Rene, and Thomas Grace. Halak, you're just thinking to yourself, well, what is this, 2010 all over again? Yeah, my thoughts exactly. I really hadn't heard much about the guy since he bombed in Long Island, to be honest. But to everyone's surprise, he's killing it this year in Boston. He is playing so well that he's pushed Tuka Rask out of the starting job. And Tuka Rask hasn't been doing badly himself either. I think his goals against average is just right around two at the moment. But Halak has just been insane. And it makes me think about, you know, back in 2010, when he took out the Penguins in the Eastern Conference semifinals. That's how well he's playing. Pecorine, he's just an ageless wonder. You know, he just turned 36 the other day. He was awarded with a two-year extension worth $10 million. And to me, it's a steal because Pecorine is truly the backbone of the Nashville Predators. And he's just insane to watch. I, I love watching him. I hate playing against him because he's that good. But he's just so much fun to watch, and it, it makes you wonder if aging's really a thing with him. And then lastly, we have Thomas Grice. For years, T Grice was the backup for San Jose, and he's been finally given a shot to start in Long Island, and he's been doing well. And let me back up for a minute. I probably shouldn't say Long Island. It's really Brooklyn, but you know, since they're splitting games there, it's really a toss up. But anyway, Grace has been another surprise to me, especially with, you know, the whole Tavares leaving Toronto and everyone saying that, you know, the Islanders really want to have a team this year. Well, not only do they have Grace playing well, but Robin Lehner is playing well too. And it's just amazing when you have a great supporting cast who just wants to be there. Um, so with all three of these goalies, I'm actually surprised in you know, different ways. With Halak and Grice, it's kind of like a career resurgence in some ways. And then with Rene, like I mentioned earlier, he's just an ageless wonder. And it's just awesome. And, you know, Boston, the Islanders, and the Predators are all playing well right now. The Predators are, of course, leading their division. The Islanders are actually leading their division. And um, even the Bruins, the Bruins are in third place right now but they're behind a very strong Tampa Bay Lightning team. So with that, we'll see how they do the rest of the year. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll talk next time.